Back in June 2022, I visited Stockholm for the first time and was completely hooked. And like always when I travel, I hit as many cafes as I can. And I decided to do a video to show you my favorite ones and why I like them. So I hope you enjoy. This coffee chain is very popular in Stockholm. You can find it almost everywhere. Uh, they offer both sweet and salty pastries and you can just sit down, work on your computer or enjoy people watching or whatever it is you like to do in a cafe. <laughs> This one is not a cafe, but it's a pretty unique place, which is why I wanted to include it in this video. If you look at it from the outside, it looks like a theater. Once you enter it, you think that it's a store, but if you step a little bit further inside, you see that it actually has a lot of restaurants and a lot of food options. So I definitely recommend it if you are in Stockholm and you are looking for a unique place to hang out in. This cafe was one of my favorites and it's the only one that I went to multiple times. They have great coffee in here, great pastries, and the atmosphere is just so nice and calming. This place can get very crowded, so if you want to go there and like, grab a seat and work for a couple of hours, I recommend you go early in the day before all that commotion happens. <laughs> This place is a little bit far from the center and I had to go there specially to check it out. It is a specialty coffee place and they make really, really good coffee. Just be aware that they don't offer Wi-Fi there. So if you're planning to go and work on your computer or something that requires the internet, it might not be the best option for you. coffee place if you want to go and do a little bit of work on your computer. I went there a little bit late in the day so I didn't have much choice of pastries so I can tell you about that but the atmosphere of this place is really really nice. One of the most famous cafes in Stockholm and I would definitely recommend going there just to check out the very unique interior design where people sign basically everywhere on the walls. It's really, really cool. I tried one pastry when I was there and it was really good and they have a large selection of pastries to choose from. However, if you wanna go there and just try one thing, I highly recommend you try the orange juice. Again, this is not a cafe, but it's very unique and I wanted to include it in this video. As you can tell from the name, everything here is made from eggs, and I mean everything. Well, not the furniture, but you know what I mean. This place is a great option if you want to just have a light meal before continuing on to your next cafe. One of the nicest cafes I've been to, and not just in Stockholm, ever. The people working there are extremely nice, and it feels like they know literally everybody that walks through the door, so it's a very nice atmosphere to be there and just experience whatever is happening. <laughs> I had there the best pastries that I had in my life, so definitely if you want to choose just one cafe to go to, this is the place to go. Last but definitely not least on this list is Mr. Cake, where you can probably find the best cakes you'll ever have. 
They also specialize in making red velvet croissant, which I've never seen anywhere else. But I didn't have it, so I'm not gonna tell you if it's actually good or not. You're just gonna have to go there and try for yourself. Because when I saw the cakes, my heart was definitely set on them and I couldn't see anything else beside them. Do I want to go back there and try everything on the menu? 100%.